hear it over our studio here in Mount Auburn. You sure can. I mean, this is our tower cam shot from high atop Karoo Tower, and you can see it's fading out. Well, not surprised that that just happened because, well, we've got intense wind and rain. Literally, I just watched a curtain of wind and rain basically blow right over downtown Cincinnati. And within this line, you're probably getting some wind gusts that are sub severe, just short of severe threshold, probably in that 50 to 50 mile an hour range. So you certainly still could get some power flickering, especially with the intense lightning that's starting to come through. Fortunately, we don't have any tornado warnings. That's the good news. That's the best news I can report because it has been an awful night across the state of Ohio, especially just north of I-70. And we'll talk more about that here in just a little bit. But for now, we've got nasty storms that have lined up right across the heart of the tri-state. Again, these storms aren't currently warned for severe, but boy, they are packing a punch with wind and rain. I wouldn't be surprised if we zoom in right here over Mount Auburn, for example, downtown Cincinnati. This is going to scoot through Bellevue, Norwood, Gulf Manor, over towards Anderson, Newtown, and Marymount. There's probably some small hail in some of this heaviest rain, along with some gusty winds, and you certainly could have some wind gusts, probably getting close 50, maybe 55 miles per hour out of this. Heavy rainfall through Sharonville, Blue Ash, cold rain, White Oak, still looking at nasty weather, but again, not severe. And the good news is, is that once expand this just a little bit for me, Adam, once this scoots through your severe threat essentially ends. Once you're behind this line, if you're up here in Butler County, Franklin County, Fayette Union counties, you're out of the threat for severe weather. Now, same story if you're up here in Warren County. So basically the threat for severe weather is now shifting to the southeast and along of Interstate 71 with these big storms that are cruising through again. Hail wind gusts 50 to 55 and some dangerous lightning is what I would expect as these storms cross the metro. Now there are severe thunderstorms and severe thunderstorm warnings down here to the southwest of Cincinnati. And what's concerning about these storms across parts of northern Kentucky, a lot of this area or some parts of this region are out of power tonight. So if you have family members that live down here, give them a call and give them a heads up for these storms. Currently, we have severe thunderstorm warnings right now in effect for Gallatin, Carroll, as well as parts of Grant and Owen counties for this thunderstorm capable of producing hail and strong winds. And I am noticing just here within the past couple of minutes on this storm to the south of Carrollton, maybe trying to develop a little hook signature on that. So nothing that's imminent, at least at the moment, but that is something of note that I'm just noticing here as we're looking at this storm. So nasty weather down here around Carrollton. We talked a lot about those folks earlier because we have crews there as well. Of course, they had the tornado down there, EF1, possible EF2 storm. That's something they'll talk more about and heavy rain down around the Owenton community. So big picture on what's happening with the radar right now. We have a tornado watch that's in effect until 4 a.m. for folks along and southeast of Interstate 71 with heavy, heavy rain, thunder and lightning lining up along the I-71 corridor. But at the moment, at least, uh, Mike and Sheree, no tornado warnings currently in effect for our area. But we've got nasty storms rolling through here. You guys could hear it on top of the studio.